it was a really hard fought point. I was really proud of the group. Um, we talked about it. They're a very good team uh, with lots of very good players. <clears throat> and given the size of the field, we felt like there was an opportunity to put them under some pressure. And uh, in terms of engagement and what we did defensively, I was really, really proud. I thought offensively we, we weren't as good as we <clears throat> have been. Um, but in spite of that, we were still able to create a few chances. And then obviously Mikey buried his so well. Uh, as I said, we wanted to be able to put them under some pressure. And we did. <clears throat> we did for large stretches, but they're a good team. And they were able to find some ways to penetrate and create some decent chances. But I think you play against a good group like that, you're never going to stifle them for the entire 90 minutes. And uh, I thought that our choices of when to go and press versus when to take away some space, uh, I thought those choices were really good. And then for me, the commitment level defensively was really something to be commended. Uh, without a doubt, attacking players gain confidence from scoring goals. And the more goals they score, the better off they, they seem to be and the higher their confidence level is. So for Mikey, he's been uh, really dangerous for us all year, creating chances for others, uh, getting some chances for himself. So for him to take that one as well as he did and finish it as well as he did, I really think that uh, it's going to be great for his confidence. I uh, know Jack was feeling something and we didn't want to take any chances with him. So <clears throat> as a result, we, we made the change. It got Johnny in the game, uh, changed our alignment a little bit, but uh, it was definitely something that was, was about Jack starting to feel something. Honestly, Brendan, we just finished this game. We're still decompressing. We don't know what it's going to look like next week, but we have a lot of good players, and we will, <clears throat> we will come up with a system and a formation and, uh, and personnel to fill the, the players who are missing for next weekend. Yeah, I think it was important. And if you look at us today, you would say maybe we looked a bit rusty with the ball, but <clears throat> our level of engagement and coordination and how we defended was excellent. And uh, the last week of training for me has been really, really good. And when the group is engaged, uh, they're really, really difficult to deal with, or we certainly can make it difficult for opponents. So <clears throat> while the three break was good in a lot of ways, we were able to get some guys healthy. Uh, it was also good in the in the fact that we were able to work on some things and really I thought a very comprehensive approach today defensively and um, had we not had all that time to work on it maybe it wouldn't have been quite as sharp. Well the biggest thing is <clears throat> to be successful in the league you want to be able to get results on the road and uh, when you are where we are we have to fight and we have to grind and this was a really good example of the group just rolling up their sleeves and working really hard and earning a point on the road against obviously a very, very good team with very, very good players. He's just matured a lot. Um, he's worked really hard at his game. He's worked really hard at many aspects of his game and his ability to <clears throat> make passes, pick out passes has improved. His ability to read things defensively, um, and make choices defensively, uh, that's really what's improved. And for where he's going, um, all of those things were necessary. And because he's worked really hard at his game, he's put himself in a great position. Now he gets to go and fulfill a dream. Um, I'm really proud of him. Uh, the first year was very hard for him. And he really worked hard in that first off season and came back and earned a position that he's never let go since. Uh, so he will be sorely missed. Um, uh, very, very good, strong, athletic defender who offers us so much in defending and as his confidence has grown, offers us a good deal in attack as well. Yeah, the, the, the feeling is that if you want to be successful in the league, you have to be able to earn points on the road. And to do so, sometimes you have to just grind. You just have to be able to work. And... Uh, I feel like for us, this is a really good example and a good reminder of who we are and who we can be. And um, the ability to work is 
or the willingness to work is probably one of this team's biggest strengths. And when they put in a shift like they did today and they were so disciplined and responsible, um, we grind. Uh, it, when we grind well, we get points on the road. And today was one of those I'm really proud because it was not easy. It was a difficult, difficult game. And players are spent. And to win games on the road, you're going to feel like that by the end. So I was really proud of the effort. Um, and certainly for us, that needs to be a feeling that we take into, into all of our road games.